I've signed on, I've done one switch there, I've done one there. Yeah, I've got one more job to do on there. Mm -hmm. Just a minute. Yeah. Okay? So back to the APIN's office in just a minute to show the current state of the system. Once I've done that, I can pick up a safety program, kind of a green one. Mm -hmm. Alright? Mm -hmm. On there, I'm going to start. Well, any sense, I'll start down here. Alright? What will really mark you on hard tomorrow? If anybody starts here and walks away from it, you must put a working lock on. Yeah? If you start there and say confirm lock, rack down, it says lock course and the bar shutters, yeah? You would have to put then working lock to circuit shutters, and then the reason would be to commence isolation. You're right with that. But if you've any sense, if it's one down here, start on the ring main unit first. So DSSE, oil switch ring to ISS, can't put that goes to the left hand column, doesn't it? All that. I don't want it to see it again in the middle. Yeah? So it's then confirm off, bit safety lock and caution side, and that will commence isolation. Agree? Mm -hmm. Now in the old days, when you look at them five order rules, when they didn't have rules like that when I was young, they used to call this the lock and label stage. Lock it up and label it. You were right. That's how I was taught. So the same rules apply today actually. So while I'm here, I've locked it up there, but what can I do here? I can label it or can't it. Yeah? So we've got two cable boxes there, haven't we? Yeah? And when you look at the table one in front of you, it'll say isolate, say Dr. Cosan, then it'll say fit danger sign. But in reality, there's absolutely no problem that when you're out down here isolating, you can do that as well. Put your danger sign on adjacent live equipment. Yeah? If you start there and put a working lock on, it looks neater because then you've, you've isolated that, then you come down here and isolate that, then you should fit your danger sign. Yeah? But you, there's absolutely no, no reason why you can't fit your danger signs after you've isolated that. Do you understand that? So you could. <coughs> oh, yeah. We need to be clear. Yeah? We need to be... These are live, aren't we? Yeah? Uh, it's only a four-day course. There is a big debate if it's, this is the right way to do the thing in reality. Um, because these are live and it's switched on. Mm. Yeah, did, you, did, you, did anybody show you that Lucy uh, SF6 ring menu around the back? No. On the uh, MOD circuit. It's made out of really thin material. And it, occasionally they put a new one in it uh, up near Bulma, I'm trying to think which water company it is. So this water company up there, there so Bulma, I put this ring, a brand new ring in. And occasionally the lights sort of did a bit of a dip. Yeah? And that went on for several months, maybe a year or two. And one night we lost everything. Yeah? They looked around and they found some scorching on the outer cable box at one side of it. When they they, they, they did the job like this, they with me, all live, and it's safe to work on that box. When they took the box from that, you know what we found? Virtually nothing. What had happened, what it was doing, the inside, the inside sheet is made out of 16 thick plate, you know, tin sheet. And what it was doing, it was getting wet, and it was tracking from the phase, you know the, the diagram on the mm. tip of the phase, yeah? It was tracking down the insulation, and it was striking onto the tin plate, and it was blowing it away. And that cleared the fault, you understand, the tin going. And they'd been doing it for a long time. And so when they actually got the cover up, all the buzz bars and all the things behind it were all live. And there's this bloody grey roll where you can get your hand in, but it just blurred it all away. So what it's done, it said, at the moment, HSE haven't stopped it. But, and this is still an acceptable way to do the job. But it does raise questions if it is safe to do it, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. And should you maybe accept the fact that you would turn off there? Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So, 
Well, like, while we're doing this, where we need to make sure that everybody knows that these are live, aren't they? Yeah. yeah. So this is DSSC, and that's a fuel switch, isn't it? The thing's oil. So I'll put oil on here. Yeah? Oh, this is oil. That's oil. That's oil. These are OCVs. So that's DSSE, oil fuel switch to local transformer cable line box. Are we okay with that? <laughs> and what are you going to fix? Change size. Change size. I know the registers say fit daily size with the of line equipment, but when you're putting it on, it's to indicate the show live, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So that's what you're doing, yeah? Uh, on the DSSE oil switch ring to D, We've got another cable end box, haven't we? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we're going to put the danger sign on there. So I'll put the D on there. I'm not so sure that's why. Right. Agree? Yeah. But I could have isolated there first, then done that, then done that. But if you look at that table one, yeah, after isolation, it's when you should do a risk assessment, put barriers up, put danger signs on. <coughs> it's be called a lock up and label up. Because you've locked up there and you've labeled up, yeah? All right, we'll come back to ISS. What am I going to do now? Confirm off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are at that. Go up here, confirm off. Yeah, rack it down and fit. Safety lock in the course of size of the buzz bar shutters. And what will that do? Um, complete. So complete isolation eventually in cable to DSSE, wouldn't it, really? Mm -hmm. Go right with that. All right, so we've. Isolated, we've got our danger signs on. The next step is what? Prove dead? Yeah, yeah. I can approve dead. Can I prove dead there? No, no. I can't yeah. prove dead here, but it's down there, can I? Yeah. All right. One or two of you missed the safety first now. And you need to have all the tools, yeah? You need a potential indicator, a proving unit, and a safety person with you. Keys, handles, all the bits I'll tell you now don't count for anything. You know, in the right hand column. They're just nice. But when you get to proving dead, it's absolutely mm -hmm. vital that you put safety person potentially in the and proving unit. They carry marks. Do you understand? <coughs> so we, here we can prove dead. What are we going to prove dead of? So in the left hand column, you should write. ISS, OCB, ring to DSSE, yeah, circuit spouts. That's what goes in that column.